great weather here at the Honda. Let's bring in my colleague as we continue our live team coverage. <laughs> this is Angela Rozier, who's been all over, but you spent a lot of time today. And today, the beginning of a special time for folks in the military. Exactly. Lots of folks here. Lots of folks lined up here. I told my dad he missed out on today, but he says he will be here tomorrow. He completely forgot about it. But again, they were honored here. It's not the, it was the first day to honor our veterans as well as um, folks who are still serving in the military. We shot some video earlier today of some of those folks. They showed up at the um, Honda Classic. Uh, they extended a big heartfelt thank you for all of those veterans today. And they also got a chance to uh, um, hang out at a hospitality tent. They also got complimentary tickets. They also got complimentary lunch as well as snacks. Now those in attendance um, got a chance to sit at that hospitality pavilion overlooking uh, the signature par 3 17th hole where um, again they had their complimentary lunch. Now we did talk with a gentleman by the name of Ed Silva and his father and they were just delighted to be there. It's a very special day to, um, to be around your brothers and your sisters and to be recognized for that. It's been a long time coming and the Honda Classic definitely has a great way to show it. And to be here with my dad just makes it that much, that much more special. I'm very lucky. Very lucky also says his father, Ed, used to work with the Honda Classic, and he says he appreciates all of the nice things that are being done for him and his son. And again, it was very exciting. You know, you really have to be here for more than one day. Mm -hmm. I was here for one day, and I didn't even get far, and lots of <laughs> things are going on, but, you know, we'll be here. <laughs> but that's so special because the veterans can come back. It's not just a one-day event or anyone in the military. It's all the way through the tournament. I was here just a short period of time, almost didn't make this. I was on the other side of the golf course, had a hustle to get over here. But again, the weather is great. Tomorrow the tournament continues, Saturday and Sunday, some of the best golfers in the world and some of the best weather in the world as well. Back to Tiffany and Felicia.